Here's a quick overview of how to sign up for a Choice account using the Choice web app. You start out at retirewithchoice.com. Click on the blue button in the top right, create account. And then this is your normal kind of email and password flow. Give us your email, confirm the email. Click on the confirmation email that you get. Come back to the sign in page. Choice makes you set up 2FA on the front end. So pick whatever 2FA app that you like. Use that to create your login here. And then you're in. These are the five main steps of the application. First one, again, is just typical account setup. Second one, basic identity info. This is name, address, country. Phone number. And then check the final box for citizen, resident, proof of income. Click the blue next step and you're on to the ID verification. Here's where we'll need birthday, social, occupation, marital status. Choose which ID you'd like. Type in the issue date and the expiration date. And next is where we'll need you to upload a picture of the ID. Use your phone camera, text it to yourself, anything you need to do to just upload that picture. This screen's really important. You want to go and kind of do some research on Roth IRAs versus traditional IRAs, decide which one you're kind of setting up, what kind of account you're setting up. Most people can mark domestic for this place. This next part, just kind of pick which asset you're most interested in. For a lot of you coming through this flow, you'll most likely be interested in the cryptocurrency. There's three packages at Choice App. We'll link you to another blog post where you can read about all of those. And you pick what kind of membership option you'd like to have and where, you're, where you'd like your Bitcoin to be custodied. Here's where you set your beneficiaries. Check the box. Submit the application. This takes you to a dashboard where you'll see all the digital assets that are available to trade. What you'll want to do next is you want to click on fund account continue. Add a bank account. And then we use a Plaid integration, which means that you will use your bank login and it'll be pretty seamless. So search for your bank. For this example, use Ally. Log into your bank as if you were on their website. Perfect. They'll do a quick identity check if that's what your bank requires. When you 2FA for your bank, then you see a list of your checking account and your savings accounts. You choose which one you'd like and you're on the deposit screen. So choose how much money you'd like to deposit then choose the tax year that you'd like to deposit. Check the box, verify. Perfect. You've opened your account and made your first deposit.